So what I want to show you today in this tutorial is how I bring illustrations into the computer, turn them into vector format, and make those into t-shirt graphics. So I'm going to show you this example, which is a pineapple. And first, I'll usually start out with a little sketch like this, uh, just pen and ink on any kind of paper. And then I'll take a photo of that, and then I'll open up Procreate app, and that's the pineapple I did. That's part of the progress, but let's, uh, let's make a new Procreate document. And we wanna make a 4,000 by 4,000 pixel file. And the other thing we wanna do is let's go here and click on insert a photo, and we can insert that pineapple. And we can also scale it up a bit. And if you look at my, my layers, there is a background, and that's just the, the white background, and there's the photo. And what we wanna do with the photo is, let's turn down the opacity, just so we can use it as a drawing guide. And the other thing we wanna do is make a new layer. And typically, the pen that I draw with, or the brush that I draw with, is the default studio pen. It's in the inking section of the brush library, and that's default in Procreate. So we're just gonna use that pen, and I'm actually gonna make this brush size pretty big because this is not gonna be a super detailed drawing. So I'm gonna start out by just drawing some lines. And we can twist our drawing canvas just to match kind of how your, your arm flows when you're drawing. And the other thing I wanna do here is let's draw an ellipse for the outside of this pineapple. And the nice thing about Procreate is if you just hold at the end of drawing an ellipse, it'll allow you to adjust things and it'll also smooth things out for you. So the next thing I wanna do is let's just erase a little bit of that area right there. I think the rest of that's gonna be okay. And you'll see where I'm going here in a second. Let's just draw out the rest of these leaves. And again, we're not worrying about any of these overlapping areas. And I'll show you why here in a second. The next thing I wanna do is I wanna just fill all the outside of this part with black. The one thing I haven't done right here is make this a watertight drawing. So if I drag black, it's gonna get in where, where those gaps were. So see how there's a gap right here? If I just fill that in, maybe fill in that right there. Now when I drag this black in, it's just gonna fill kind of the outside and it's gonna stop wherever those lines make it stop. And with this method, none of this stuff needs to be totally perfect because I'm going to take it into Photoshop and apply a few effects that way. So let's, uh, let's turn off this sketch here in the background. It's starting to look pretty good. And just kind of finish it off with maybe some little lines in the middle of the leaf there. Maybe one right here, and if you get any little kinks, just you can tap two fingers to undo in Procreate. And the only other area that's bothering me, I could erase this or I could just draw in white. So I'm just gonna draw in white. Same difference for what we're doing. So what I wanna do is I wanna share this to my desktop computer and bring it into Photoshop. So we can click right here and click on the share tab. And then I usually export it as a PSD file or a PNG. A PNG is gonna be a flattened file. And with something like this, it doesn't matter because it's just black and white. Um, if we drew a bunch of layers, we would wanna save it as a PSD. But I'll just do a PNG here and I'll just airdrop that to my Mac and we'll open that up in Photoshop.